What's up guys, in this video I'm going to demonstrate to you my prototype for the final year project which is in fact a PHP driven fantasy football league website so without further ado let's start the video. Okay the first thing I'll do is, or the first thing I have to do is just open PHP, that's open now, the next thing I'll do is go to the Apache web server, start all of that, so go to the manage servers, start all let that run get out of that so now if I go to Safari I go to PHP my admin copy that not even that if I just go localhost put that in there go to PHP my admin from here you see the databases are all here it's going to be in users. I'll go to that later. But if I go back to PHP Storm, click on Safari. So that is the website that I currently made. It was all coded in PHP Storm. I have a button for the home. I have a register button. Then I can view all the users. Then I can change the password of the existing users. Then I can log in. Once I log in, it shows that I can log off as well. So if I click home, that's all I get. Now if I go to register, I can register myself. I can also see all the registered users. If I go to users, these are all the registered users. At the minute, you might not be able to see them because I've just hid them for privacy reasons and whatever. Let's go to register. Let's register a brand new account. So if I say Samsung or something or whatever, the email address would be, if I just copy this, put it in there, copy that again put it in there and say Samsung Galaxy or to keep it short just SA where did I get A from SG at gmail.com so I might just write all this down in case I forget and I can put the password as one two three one two three confirm the password okay if I do register it'll say something like you haven't filled this in the passwords don't match so if I do one two three which we'll zoom into that again one, two, three. If I do register now, it should say thank you, you're registered. So if I just write the password down, one, two, three, one, two, three. If I now go on to log in, if I go on to sg at gmail.com, if I just increase all this, one, two, three is the password. If I do, if I put in a wrong password, say login. Do you want me to say the password? Not now. Wrong password there. SG. Save the password. Okay, you are now logged in. I can also log out. If I go, if I click log out, it takes me back to the home page. If I go to change the password, I can change this to one to confirm the new password you have been updated if I now go to login the password was one two go to login yes update the password I need it updated if I now go back to here if I refresh the page or reload the page you can now see that the Samsung Galaxy details have been updated into the database and the password is all encrypted I can't see in the database only the users can see it. I can see when they registered Okay, so that's it for this video. I just demonstrated to you guys my final year project university prototype for the PHP driven fantasy football league website. And that's it really. I mean, now the aim is to make the actual game where users can log in, register, play against one another, create a league, join the league, create a league go head to head and see who wins I mean that's it really if you look at existing fantasy football websites and see how they function mines will be similar to that but different it won't be the same if it's the same I'll get done for plagiarism we're not here to plagiarize or copyright or copy anything we're here to make things out of scratch that's what programmers do that's it for this video I'll see you guys in the next tutorial thanks for now